If you have watched all the previous marine senses videos, you learned that animals in the ocean have the same five senses that we have. These senses being sight, smell, taste, touch, and hearing. Did you know that sharks have a sixth sense? But before we get into that, let's have a quick recap of their other five senses. A shark's vision differs based on the species of the shark. Some sharks have a wide range of vision, almost a 360 degree range. Some have an adaptation to see better in low light or dark conditions, and some are sensitive to light. The leopard shark and the horn shark, as you see here, they live in shallow waters and that receives a lot of sunlight, so they don't need sharp vision. We know that shark smell is amazing. People have nostrils that aid in smelling and breathing. In sharks, their nostrils are only for smelling. This gives them an incredible sense of smell. It's so good that they can even tell the direction the smell is coming from to help track their prey. Some sharks require a high fat diet while others don't. So this means they will taste their food before they accept or reject the piece. They have a tongue made out of cartilage. They also have taste buds on their tongue, all over the inside of their mouth, and even in their throat. Sharks don't have hands like us, so the way that they touch things is with their mouth. Their teeth are pressure sensitive, which helps identify something if it's edible or not. Their skin is also special in that they have modified scales called dermal denticles. Dermal meaning skin, denticles meaning teeth. Their scales are also pointed backwards, so if you touch a shark from the head to the tail, it can feel smooth. If you touch it from the tail to the head, it will feel rough. Sharks don't have ears like us. Instead, they have tiny holes on the side of their head that connect to their inner ear. Since vibrations travel through water much better than they do in air, this gives sharks an advantage to detect low frequency vibrations, such as an injured prey. Sharks have all the same senses as us, but they also have a sixth sense. This sense is not just for sharks, but also for rays and skates, which are included in the group of fish called chondrichthys, or cartilaginous fish. Their sixth sense is a sense of electroreception, and which makes them such skilled predators. Electroreception is the ability to detect electrical impulses. On the shark's snout, they have hundreds to thousands of tiny pores called ampullae of Lorenzini. Here we can see these pores close up. Every time an animal moves their muscles, every time there is a heartbeat, it gives off an electrical impulse, and this is what the sharks can detect. For example, if there is a clam buried under the sand and it's breathing by moving the water in and in and out of its siphon, a shark can detect that. Here in this clip, we can see the horn shark using several of its senses, including the electroreception, to find its prey. I hope you learned a few new facts about the animals that live in our oceans. And we hope to see you soon at the California Science Center.